Hi, my name is Ditech, CTO of DVS, and welcome to another how-to video. Keep liking, sharing, and subscribing on all our social media platforms, whether it's LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube. We really appreciate the feedback. The marketing guys love hearing from you and passing those comments back, and it's very humbling for the nice comments. What I really want to talk about before we move on is in the UK currently this week is Mental Health Awareness Week. And just remember, it's okay not to be okay. We're focused on body image this time around, and I can speak personally, I suffer from body image. Um, I put a bit of weight on recently, I'm not comfortable with how I look, I know I probably don't look um, like I have, but I do suffer from it myself, and I don't feel I look like everybody wants me to look and don't fit in with that standard generic profile of uh, being beautiful, muscly, t-shirt off, tanned, that's not me either. So just remember, it's okay not to be okay. There's always somebody there that can help talk, whether it's online forums, even if you have to email or ring TVS, there's always somebody that will help you through it. And just remember, talking about it will help us all overcome it. Let's not hide it away. Let's bring it out into the open and together we can be stronger. Okay, so moving on. To make this note a little bit lighter, what we are gonna do is give away this Veracity pinpoint wireless link so in the box you get this lovely lovely thing this lovely wireless device so you connect it to a PoE network and enter the PoE camera to it you use your smartphone app which lets you connect to the camera and do the setup whether it's just focusing or some adjustments whatever that needs so we're going to give this pinpoint wireless device away these are quite expensive so it is a nice giveaway and i've decided to give that away for my own personal stock it's brand new all you have to do to have a chance and it's only uk based so all you have to do to have a chance of winning this pinpoint wireless is email marketing at dvs.co.uk for in the next by the end of may where we'll draw the winner and just give us a suggestion of what you want to see in our video whether it's a specific equipment whether it's a specific funny scenario whether you want to see um i don't know me sleeping for eight hours whatever that is drop us a suggestion to that email address and we'll pick the winner on the funniest comment and that will be on its way to you so today we're going to take a look at the new Hike Vision tools. So the Hike Vision tools is downloaded onto your desktop and it's a management tool that all the sub tools can be downloaded and updated within one package. Previously we had to update, you know, download and then continually update manually all of the tools ourselves. If you're anything like me, my desktop is an absolute mess. So this is a very nice, neat way of keeping it all together and having all the updates in one place automatically so it'll look really nice. I'm gonna transfer you to my PC now and I'm gonna give you a quick run through of it, but don't forget, enter the competition and see you next week on the how-to video next week. Thanks, guys. Okay, welcome back. So first thing you need to do is open up the web browser on the PC that you want to download the Hike Vision tools to. So I'm gonna use our website, www.dvs.co.uk because it'll help um, raise our hit rate and our SEO. So go to there, go to support, and then download where all our downloadable material is. Scroll down to the bottom and it's the Hike Vision Tools Manager. You click download. It'll redirect you as a Dropbox link. Good old Dropbox. Wait for that to load. Now, Internet Explorer and Dropbox can be funny. Right click, like it is now. There we go, direct download. Save as, I'm gonna save it to the desktop. quite quick there we go done so we can close that close this down yes on the desktop then we can see the tools manager will extract that and we can run it yes I want to run that read and accept install now start now So, this is the tools manager. So you can see all of the tools within here, I can download. So none of them currently are downloaded. So for instance, I'm gonna download SADP, lens selection tool, batch configuration, VS player, MVA is the mobile video application, but we're not gonna use that. Remote backup, Hike Vision design tool, storage and network cal calculator. 
they're all downloading you can see the percentage there what you can do is press on the uh, system configuration icon and you've got a saving pass so you can edit that if you need to but it also tells you the current version of the tools manager I can click on check for update check in fail it is the latest update as the tool manager gets updated we'll be able to click it and update it from there but not only the tool manager itself but the actual tools will be able to be managed and updated so we'll just wait for these to come on And you can see all of the little ones that are downloading. They're all the ones I'm downloading on the right hand side. So it is stacked them. If you go to my tools now, you'll see the ones that are downloaded. So they'll just come in. You can open them from this application. And you'll also see an upgradable tools um, tab. If I click on that, there's none to upgrade. As they become upgradable, so new versions come out, you should be able to upgrade them within this tool manager. The whole point is they're all kept in one place. As they become updatable, you can click on them to update it, but they're all, I've only just downloaded this, so they should be the most recent ones. And as they come online, there's going to be another one. Come on. Everything takes ages when you're looking. So go to my tools. If I want to open SADP, I just click open and that will open that tool there. Allow it access, click allow. So that's SADP and I can do whatever I need within that SADP tool, close that. If I want batch configuration, I can click batch configuration tool. Again, run it through there. And I've done videos on batch configuration SADP, so I can then close that down. Yep, uh, lens selection, open that, and I'll open the lens selection tool. There we go. I've done a video on that. VS Player, again, same. Open, there we go. And remote backup. Remote backup, I haven't done a video on yet, but I plan to do a video on that very soon. Um, really powerful tool if you know what to do with it for manual schedule backups, video certs, etc. I'll do a separate video on that. So we'll close that down. Storage and network calculator. And of course, I can select one and delete it. So if I select it and then drag it to the uh, bin tool there, it deletes it. You can see drag and hold it and it'll delete that if you no longer require it. Nothing to update. But because I've just deleted that, I'm going to have to download that again. But that's as simple as it gets. So I can actually close that down, exit now, yes. And you'll see whenever I want to access those tools, I can go to the shortcut that is created on my desktop, double click on it. It will open up my tool manager. Well, it would have if I double clicked. It's the wireless mouse. There we go, everything's there. There's all my tools, but I will have to re-download them again because I closed it before they finish. And you can see how easy this tool manages. We're gonna cut, it's gonna make your life very easy, all in one place. All of the updates are going to be shown, so go and download it now and be very happy that um, all this moving forward will be easy for you and you'll have the latest. Hope you enjoyed it. Any questions, please drop us a line. Don't forget to enter the competition and we'll see you next week for the next how-to video. Take it easy, take care, speak soon. Peace out. See you soon. Cheers.